tuned for a special Channel 9 feature on ultrasound. There's no other skyline like it anywhere. All over the world, people come to cities to make a living. You come to this city to make a difference. How's the new office coming? Everything is going quite well, thank you. Uh-huh, fine. An attorney, arranging for a loan to open her own office. She's making her mark here, like so many before her. You can complete this application here. More than its fine harbor and good climate, New York has always had people with ideas, energy, ambition. When he came here in 1772, Alexander Hamilton found business already active. A new chamber of commerce was four years old. A dozen years later, Hamilton opened the very first bank. Today, New York has hundreds of banks. It's the financial capital of the world. Transactions from millions of dollars to cashing personal checks for a lot less. A single $5 bill. Watch it travel through the city in the course of a day. You'll learn as much about commerce in the infinite city as you can from all the many financial institutions that call New York home. a birthday gift for a friend. One of many times that $5 bill will change hands today. A purchase, a sale every second in the fashion center of the nation.
infinite city. More than 80 museums, many hundreds of galleries, an endless throbbing vein of cultural and entertainment opportunities. will take them to a concert. People like them spend more than $3 billion a year going to New York's theaters, concerts, and cultural events. $5 bill. And where it stops might just be in the hands of a Cincinnati import executive in New York on business, having coffee on the run. executive is in town for a meeting at the New York Coliseum. Soon the city's going to have an even larger one. And with more than 28,000 restaurants and many fine hotels here, the variety is infinite in the infinite city. universities, more than 120 in the New York area, full-time, part-time, with the great city itself as a unique urban campus. Yes, indeed. Yeah. Many, many. Are you from out of town? Yes. Yeah, I, uh, 
I live in Cincinnati. Last fare of the day for the cabbie. And the last stop today for the $5 bill. Thank you. Tomorrow, it's going to start traveling all over again in this international city that never sleeps. Three million people work here, New Yorkers, young and old. Some born here, others from all over the world, skilled in countless wondrous ways, and with 10% of the nation's purchasing power. Their energy, drive, creativity, given excitement and vitality to life here that is, when all is said and done, exactly what New York is all about. For people may go to other cities to make a living. They come here to make a difference.